uh, manifold I showed you in the last video, it's done. Another manifold to do the LHT intercooler mod on. I'm just gonna box this and send it out. So hopefully you're watching this video if you know this is yours. So I've got three layers of bubble wrap and then this will also help keep the shape of the box. I'm gonna cut the box down so it fits this better. All right, there it is. Uh, it's always better to overpack. So we include this with our clutch install kits for the S2000s and I think the shift rebuild kits. But if this is something you want to get separately, this has been really hard to get a hold of. This stuff is, I think it's on a year of back order right now. So we have enough to make more of these than we need for our kits. So I'm basically packing them, getting ready. But if this is something you think we should sell separately in the store, this is the Aurora grease. It's, it's by far the best stuff. We've tried other products tried the high temp grease from the parts store it's gonna make your clutch creak you're gonna have issues with it it's gonna suck would you buy this for five bucks yeah okay five? yeah you get a lot a two for ten two yeah yeah it's actually a better deal because you get two it's not starbucks but i got us a coffee i like to do the coffee drag race really dark hey I don't know this happened I put vanilla in there I thought it was vanilla cream but it's not it's just vanilla taste vanilla so it's taste. dark it's like dark black so if you try if you don't like it I won't be offended if you chuck it <laughs> oh it's hot I just went to sip it at 9,000 degrees anyway it's the thought that counts George yeah. it's like if I bought you a gift if I thought you like it you hate it it's the thought that counts. Just a couple of months And ago. it sucks. It takes like 40 minutes to print a page. It does take And a if you ever print, if you click on three, it takes days. It does. It's so... And then it says, and then it says, oh, uh, there's a problem with the printing. And then it just, yeah. Yeah. This you can only cheap. put, I think you can only put like <laughs> six pages in here and then it clogs it up and it jams. You get a paper jam. Oh. It, that, that what does that do? Up there and look it looks like it should have a hinge or something. It this... sits there. I don't know. So it's generally annoying. Yeah, the is. good news is Esther has a brand new printer and she's keeping it in the box because she doesn't want to get it dirty. Yeah, I'm keeping it nice. She's been nice hanging. <laughs> she's been hanging out with me too long. <laughs> there it is, right there. <laughs> it came just before our dragon trip, so we've had it about two weeks. Two weeks, and Esther doesn't want to use it. Set it up. It's just set it, just plug it in and just go through like four hours of programming and it'll work. Just four hours of programming is right. This stuff has been on order for so long, Esther. It has. And it's finally coming in. It's finally coming in and now we have like a ton of the phones, which I know some people really wanted. So I'm thinking maybe we should stick them on the school rock by themselves. Like yeah, the people have been asking for those. Yeah. A lot of this stuff we try and keep together in kids, but with these have been so hard to get. I mean, we keep ordering like 10 and 20 and 30 and they just never did ship them. All of a sudden, yeah. it's like Honda's caught up and they went, okay, here's all your phones. Wow, those things are back. Those have been super hard to get. Yeah, and we've got the... This is the oil filter. This doesn't taste good at all. Ready? See? <laughs> I'm gonna circle K right here. Somebody's gonna say, why didn't you just go to Starbucks and go get them to make you a coffee and it'd be absolutely fantastic. Guess what I'm gonna be for Halloween? Thanks, Jeff, for the hookup. <laughs> it was the only way I could buy it that didn't have actual creamer. It's sugar-free vanilla. Do you want some in there? Now you know what Mike deals with on a daily basis. <sighs> That's good. On with the movie. It's a tool you've seen. I did a video on this. This is the genuine Honda piece. It fits on the filter super tight. Yeah. Obviously, breaking it loose makes a, a big difference, but also when you torque it on the S2000s, they're notorious for coming loose. Keep an eye on your oil filter, guys. They do come loose. We get them coming in where we're doing oil change, they do. and the oil filter is tight. These are the slides. These are for the, the clutch, clutch kits. kits. So we'll have those back in stock, too. Nice. Yeah. Wow, it's going to be going to be busy around here. That's right. That's just in the last, like the second pickup today right there. We've yeah. already done one. 
but I think we should definitely, oh, we got a couple of discs, discs. discs down there too. Definitely yeah. We finally got caught up on Aurora Grace because that's been on back order for a long time and we've had that on order for like nine or ten months. Don't know, you get a dog attack? <laughs> what the heck does that happen? Get out of here! <laughs> mentioned in the last video, we're selling the CRX shirts off for ten bucks each. Cost on these things is $8.99, actually $8.97 plus the art. So right now these are basically cost. Uh, this is all we have left as of today, 12 small, 12 medium four large uh that says 10 but looking at that there's a lot less there's five and one xl left after that all the crx stuff is sold this is sebastian's by the way as to a thousand bags these are on sale for 99 bucks that is a terrific price when you see these things they are top quality they have the lht branded on there the s2000 logo we have them in silver we have them in red we have them in blue and we have some in yellow. This is the last of the batch. After that, we have to water more. They do come from Bahrain. They take a little bit of time to get made. It's got more pieces made. We're gonna be putting our bleeder buckets together here soon. We have some more on order. We have plenty of koozies left. That's the last of the blue. When I just found out, our t-shirt guy that makes these koozies has sold his business. So this will be the last of the batch because t-shirt labs don't offer these. So same thing, once these are gone, they're gone. We don't have another manufacturer for them. We don't want to buy the ones that you see for four cents a piece. They're absolutely awful. So we have ordered more shift boots, but we do have a few left. I think we have about four or five of each color left. Yellow, silver, blue, and red. These are nice quality, 100% leather. I think that is Esther right there, looking at the laptop with a Starbucks coffee. Um, if you went to the classic Hunters on the Dragon meet and you saw us there, we give a few of these away. This is really cool. It's a CRX key ring. This is one of the special edition key rings that our friend Jeff made. But my favorite key ring by far is this one right here. This is one of those that really stood out to me. It's obviously a cylinder head or a cylinder head gasket and it has the black back in and then the LHT cut out. This is really cool. I gotta do a review on this. We've been working on this, uh, working with it for about a month or so, it's one of those drains that you put under the car and you drain the oil into it and it stores it, then you can suck it out when need be. And we're doing this after hours and whenever we get time, basically. This is a planned kit that we've had in the works for a while. It uses the new Garrett G25 660 turbo, which if you've seen that, it's their newest generation, little tiny turbo, but it has the uh, ability to make 660 horsepower. I don't know exactly what combination it makes that power. It kind of seems hard to believe, but my idea is if this kit will make 500 plus, it's a nice compact turbo. We're building our own manifold. It's a little shorty, four into one, and then a full three inch downpipe, and it's gonna match up right over to our cat right here. This is something, don't rush me, don't say, hey, is it ready, I wanna water it, because I don't even know if it's gonna be a kit that will sell. It might be a kit that will sell installed only but this should give us a lot more potential uh, super fast spool up and a nice tight package which is kind of the design we like we like the oem design and fitment and i believe this is the way honda would do it if they were going to do it is to place the turbo down low but have plenty of room for a drain and as you see we've got our factory mount in there thank you all you guys that sent the Starbucks cards and Bob was the last guy that sent us a bunch of Starbucks cards. So we're putting them to good use. George stopped by Starbucks today. Talking of Starbucks, keep an eye on my Instagram. Just got off the phone with Corsa and I'm super excited about this because they're sponsoring a build. And it's often difficult to get companies to sponsor your stuff because they're, they obviously give you a product, they need something in return. Well, however you do it, whether you send them viewers, whether you send them uh, advertisement, whether they sell more products because of your video or whatever you do. So it's tough to get these sponsors. A lot of companies shy away from the guy that contacts them and says, hey, I am this guy and I've built this and I have a, you know 5,000 subscribers on Instagram. Give me something free. Well, they're not going to get anything in return. You got to think if they sell you a four thousand dollar exhaust, there is for them maybe thirty percent profit in it. So they need to recoup three plus just to break even. So you have to sell three exhausts more 
would obviously help. So that is often a tough sell. That's why a lot of companies shy away from uh, sponsorships because they don't get enough in return. And if they're already an established company and they're making money, why would they give you free stuff? So keep that in mind when you're reaching out to companies. Try and give them something before you ask for something. I know it sounds silly. Let's say you're looking at getting some LED bulbs from a company, but buy some of their LED bulbs first. Make it on your Instagram, make it on your YouTube, make it on your platform that you've bought them and that you're doing an install and show the before and after. Basically give them something before you ask for something. It goes a long way, trust me. It's something that I learned a long time ago. That's something I do a lot. Building a relationship with a company before you start begging for stuff. Hey, can you give me some bulbs for my car? I really like it. And I have a car club and you know, there's 7,000 people in my car club and they're all waiting on me. As soon as they get the bulbs and see it, 7,000 people are gonna buy your bulbs. You're gonna be unbelievable. You're gonna be bigger than Amazon. Companies don't buy that anymore. Buy their bulbs first, sell their product for them and then ask for free stuff. It works, trust me. You saw earlier in the video, we have a bunch of these foams come in. This is the Honda OEM foam, and it's been on back order for so long. And if you're an S2000 guy, if you've ever taken your center console apart, this usually disintegrates, it's weird. It's, it's like 10 years or so, it turns to mush. I mean, you can mold it into, it's like Play-Doh. And it's been so hard to get. It's one of those things that you don't think about it until you put a new one in. It does a good job at controlling the sound. The S2000 is loud and you hear a lot of transmission noise. This tends to isolate that. That's why Honda call it an isolator. The other good news is look at this. This is from a manufacturer. Uh, we met him through the Red Dell Saw build. Christian, thank you so much. We told him how hard these are to get a hold of. He said, well, I'm in manufacturing. He's now gonna start manufacturing these for us. So not only will we have more of them than we need for our kids, we're gonna start selling them separate in the store. So look out for that. I'm excited about that. And it's actually a little bit cheaper than this. So we're trying to pass the savings on to you. I mean, which one is which? You see it? It's terrific. Well, look out for that. In the meantime, see you in the next video. Don't forget, enjoy your cars. Hit the subscribe, hit the like, share, whatever you gotta do. Thanks for being a part of what we do. And thanks for tuning in to see what we're doing in the background. I know this wasn't a build video. It was a what's going on at LHT video. But don't forget, hit the store, lhtperformance.com. Get your CRX t-shirt for 10 bucks while they last. Once they're gone, they're gone. Esther is working on a new shirt. She's having it ready. So if you wanna buy it for Christmas, you wanna buy it for your friend for Christmas, you wanna buy it for your husband, your wife, it's gonna be in the store. I think it's gonna be a long sleeve for you guys that are experiencing the cold weather. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video. Don't forget, enjoy your cars.